Hello, and welcome back to Pokemon Fire Red, Ashlock. As always, I am the Ixalan. This is Red. We're here with our team. Still waiting to see Shade Dew's Hydro Cannon. We're here on Three Island. We're gonna clean up this town. Hey, seriously, what's up? No, it doesn't. I thought I was actually... Oh, there's the group people we're gonna fight. Okay, that's fine. Berry Forest? That's cool. How do I get to Berry Forest? But boats can do it? Okay. Oh, hey. Nice. Alright. That's good to know. I guess they finished their thing. Uh, yeah. Since we're about to do some fighting... Maybe I did deliver the meteorite last episode and I wasn't paying attention. Wait, there's a way to tell. Key item. No? So I got the meteorite. Oh well. Dude, it's a resort island. You just, like, lounge around. Why would you bring a bunch of bikes out here? There's not even good pathing for bikes. You want to be, like, in big cities or something. like Or, like, long coastal continents that have, like, highways that you can ride. This doesn't make any sense why you came out here. I'll make you leave. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to lose any money to you, buddy. Oh, that's a cute coughing. Shades Hydro Cannon. Holy crap. Water is so powerful, it inverted light. That was kind of cool. Oh, I feel like I have to sneeze. Oh, it's like Hyper Beam. You have to recharge. Oh, sneezed. And I'm poisoned. Alright, James. Get in this thing. Minimize, huh? Alright. Does Haze affect me or them? That I always forget. We'll find out. Among all Pokemon engaged in battle. Okay. No minimize, bitch. None of that shit in here. He apparently didn't listen to a single word I said. I don't know. I think doing a quarter of your health for not very effective is it's all right. I can I can just haze win, like. Yeah. What do you? One minimize. That's fine. I mean, at this rate, you're never gonna get anything done. <sighs> Fucking that one minimize apparently was enough. There we go. See, so yeah, it's a four hit kill? Okay. Whereas you're doing five damage? Alright. You got this, James! I believe in you. Jesse's rooting you on from beyond the grave. Oh. My nose is like, I want to sneeze. But you've already sneezed, so we'll wait and just irritate you. And then we'll sneeze again in a minute. Isn't this, like, is this not part of Kanto? Like, what is, what are these islands? Is this Hawaii, basically? Is that, is that what this is? Like, because I know Kanto is supposed to be part of Japan. So then is this Thailand or Hawaii or what's going on here? I guess Hawaii would be what this is. Maybe the... 
um, what are those, there's that island that we have a naval base on that's like smack dab in the middle of nowhere, like due west, not due west, but like somewhere west, probably west and north of Hawaii. I left shades in front, and, oh, because I couldn't switch. Crap. That was, I got attacked, okay. We're gonna, we're gonna antidote. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe not. I guess we won't antidote. There's no need to antidote. I'm gonna keep embarrassing you guys if you keep attacking me. One Grimer? This is what you come at me with? You make me sad, dude. I just don't want to be poisoned anymore. So I'm gonna go into... James, so that I don't take any poison damage. Antidote my Blastoise. Because this Grimer, I don't think, can ever hurt me. Yeah. Then Haze, and then I might kill it with, with James. I didn't mean to sludge, but it hit, so I'm not going to complain. Hey, you see how I use one move to eliminate the past three moves that you've done? And this is actually a key example of why stat changes are not super effective in standard, like, Pokemon. In a, in a like, a 6v6 competitive battle, hazing is generally not something you're going to be able to do very often. And, uh, and stopping a Pokemon from setting up, well, useful, you're better off usually doing more damage. Certain Pokemon are fast enough that they can do a... A stat change and then go into an attack but you don't want to stack multiple stat changes at least not unless you're like behind a, a substitute or something what is this guy doing is poison poison's physical okay I just I was just real I'm like why is he acid armor like I can't help against but it has been, and I wasn't paying attention. So poison is, is physical in Gen 3, it seems. Yeah, that's not doing anything. Hit you with the sludge. All right, so that does, okay. So that'll kill you, maybe. I'm gonna try Shockwave. I just wanna see how much damage it'll do. Apologize if you just heard a crack. I, uh, sometimes I crack my Elbows or knuckles. Try not to do it a lot uh, while recording, because I'm sure it's not a pleasant sound, but that one couldn't be helped. Sometimes they just crack when I move. <laughs> Meh. What are you gonna do? I don't even. Dude! I just wanna find. The guy I'm supposed to give this rock to. Do you want this rock? Because if you can take this rock, then I'm free. I just, I apparently, I want to leave these islands. Suck a hydro cannon! Oh, it just looks so cool. I really like that animation. Part of me wants to know what it looks like in, in Gen 6 when they added like 3D stuff. Okay, so you're gonna hit me with the sludge. Wow, okay. That was, no, I don't wanna risk that. I forgot that how bulky Muck can be and that did way more damage than I thought. Well, I remember how bulky Muck could be. I didn't expect it to do that much damage. Wow, he's really powerful. Kinda, kinda concerned here. Thank you for the crit, Jeff. Jeff's like, I'm just ready to be in battle again. It's been forever. You want this thing dead? Mind rape. Good job, Jeff. Appreciate the support. So good. Get off the island. The hayseed? How is that? I don't even care. I don't even care. You're just that you're gone, and that's the important thing. Because now I can hopefully find somebody 
to give this stupid meteorite to, and then I can go back to collecting gym badges. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I have to go find the little girl that's lost. And be and be an hero. Hey, alright. That was kinda worth it. Bond Bridge. Okay. I don't know what that is. What's up? Dang it. Okay. Alright, I'm I'm on board. Okay. Interesting. Ooh, a Pokemart. I haven't seen one of these in a while. Uh yes. Doesn't really sell a lot of interesting stuff. I mean, it sells some stuff, but... Ooh, Hyper Potions. Let's get some of those. Yup. And then... Eh, I guess we're good. I don't really need any of the rest of that. Berries, huh? And they never run out. Alright. Down for some infinite berry glitches. What's in here? Oh, hey. What's up, little kid? Well, that's rude. Why are you lying to your kid? Ghosts? Like, ghastlies? Haunters? Dude, there's a Gengar. I'm gonna catch it. Oh, well, we're never gonna get that item because I'm not doing the cut thing. Huh. I mean, this is you're actually probably more populated than Pallet Town in all reality. You're definitely more popular than Pallet Town. Huh. Alright, well, let me do what you want to do. It's your house. I was just here to see you be like, hey, do you want to give me stuff? Because, I mean, if you want to give me stuff, I'm all for that. I'm not even going to respond to that guy. Yeah. She's kind of weird, man. I don't know... Like, she's got a rep because she does the psychic thing, but just be, please be cool. Why would I be quiet when crossing? There's... There's something down here that I could get? No? Probably couldn't even walk there in all reality. Yeah, I couldn't. I guess there's just like a hidden item right there. Oh well. Alright, Bond Bridge. Let's see... What do we have in Bond Bridge? Alright, we got a double battle coming up. Let's make sure we're ready for that. Forgot Shades needs to stop being in the front. He's definitely way too high of a level. I think that's good. I think we're good with that setup. What's up, ladies? Uh, Clefairy? Jigglypuff? Um... Oh, how was right the first time? Clefairy. I'm trying to think of like my third guess, but I mean, when in doubt, when you see a cute kid and they're like, my favorite Pokemon, you're like, Clefairy. Alright, so then. I think we need to straight up kill this one. Yeah, Wing Attack and Sludge. James and Terra. Good freaking combo, I like it. What the fuck is cosmic power? Defense? Special defense. Okay. There's a... Uh... I think that's a combo with Zatu and... Or not... Yeah, Natu and Zatu. The, like, totemic bird looking thing. Metronome? Oh, thank god. Metronome is... God, that's terrifying. Of course you're in love. Yes, you suck ball. Oh, nice! You broke out of it. Good job. I hate how love is like a crappy version of paralysis. Except without the speed down. I just... I'm in love. I don't want to hurt you. Ah. Anyways, Natu and Zatu can... I think there's... Or no, maybe it's not Natu and Zatu. I thought it was. It's all, it could also be Sigilith that I'm thinking of. One of those, you can use Cosmic Power to boost two of your stats up and get, like, plus six on each. 
And then there is an item, I think, stored power. Or not an item. There's a move like stored power or something that does damage, increased damage for each stat up you have. So if you also did like three sword stances in that, it would be like plus 18, so it would be crazy. Uh, I don't want to fight this. I have no interest in it. We're going to fight this battle though. What's up, girly? Are you going to be a cool trainer? You look like you could be a cool trainer. I haven't fought a cool trainer in a really long time. Oh, you're Aroma Lady Violet. Okay. Aroma Lady Violet. Sending out the Bulbasaur. James from Team Rocket. Using Sludge to kill Bulbasaur. Not too bad. Pretty reasonable. What else you got? Keep bringing it. Ivysaur. Alright. We can do that again. Oh, okay. I see what you're doing there. I mean, I'm going to sleep anyway, so may as well try a shockwave. See, see what happens. How much damage is a razor leaf going to do? Not that much. Not very effective. Oh, good. Woke up first turn. That's pretty good. Hit him with a shockwave. Ooh, that was not good. Sweet set reduces my evasiveness. Which is really a very useless skill in the grand scheme of things. Like, evasion is not a measurable skill. It's like a, a very small chance that you just dodge an attack naturally. And, I mean, oh, I don't know. That's just like a bad move. Worse than minimize, because at least minimize, like, it's like an accuracy reduction, but it's permanent on you as long as you have it. So, like, even if they switch Pokemon, it'll still be an accuracy reduction for them. Whereas removing their evasiveness is like an accuracy boost for you, but only against them, like that one Pokemon. I don't know if that really made sense, but it did in my head. That was just not a good, not a good move. Ivy Sword gives solid experience though. I'm kinda good about that. I'm kinda glad about that. Oh, thank you. She's like I can't tell like the, the, the glitter around her and how happy she was. Like I feel like she might be tripping. Like she might have just been tripping balls on mushrooms or something. Hey, what's up, little girl? Yay, yay, Pokemon! Plah! Oh, that's adorable. With the little star, you, or, or with the little pigtails and the tube, and she's like running back and forth. Like, I have all these water Pokemon. But holy crap, man, she could give Blaine a run for his money at that freaking. At uh, that freaking level. 34 star, you? Dang. Ah. Uh... Why? Why you troll me, Star You? At least Bubble Beam, I believe, is only a speed down at worst, and it's not like I don't have the worst speed. <laughs> uh, I was right on that, at least. That made me feel better. Boom. Oh, Star You fell asleep. Getting slashed. I feel like you could use slash to refer to getting crunked or drunk or effed up. I mean, obviously not with like a small five-year-old girl in a tube or something. That'd be kind of weird. Hey, Quick Claw! Yay! Just ignore that last conversation I had. We're just gonna move past it. Just move past it. Just got more star using stuff. Alright, I'm okay with this. I mean, if you guys want to go Slash versus Swift all day... I think I, I think I come out ahead on that. That works out pretty well for me. Oh, Krabby, huh? As long as you don't have, like, guillotine or something. Mud shot. Unexpected. Really? Why are they attacking my speed? I thought... 
No, I was thinking I was grass poison. I was like, I thought ground would be very effective, but it's not. I'm, I'm grass bug. And so I think bug, I guess bug resist ground? Huh, interesting. All right, just go to sleep. Stop bothering me with my speed. It's really sad, leave me alone. There we go. Sleepy Krabby is sleepy. And in return, we get to dig. Woo! I want a Krabby. Do we have a Krabby? I don't know if the Pokeball, like, I know the Pokeball won't show up because the sleep is there. But I can't remember if Pokeballs show up on trainers' Pokemon to show that you have them. Or not. I'm going to check after this. Oh, now you want to use Stomp? I don't care about your Stomp. Get out of here, Krabby. Yeah, I didn't see the Pokeball there. I don't think. Kind of editing if I did. And there will be a comment mocking myself. Uh, let's see. We got a good, good show up here. And Han Ponyta, Ghastly. We do have a Krabby. Yay! That's good that the pincers are growing back, but that's really sad. Who would tear off a Krabby? Oh. I saw this image of like people keeping Krabbies like in, in things, just like ripping off their claws to have like lobster claws for for dinner. That got really dark, and the Krabby just like regrows them every couple days. All right. So let's take on... Didn't want to fight you yet, but sure. Sure, why not? I was going to go pick on the tuber, but we'll be nice. Yeah, look at how, like, sparkly and happy she is, Aroma Lady. She's, she's probably on something. All right, so Sludge is not going to kill you. It's going to be a two-hit kill. Holy crap. Unexpected. But appreciated. All right, so almost guaranteed to hit here. Right? Yes. Okay. Acid. Meh. I was really, I was expecting a status effect, like because of the the chick on Mount Ember that just, God, that was awful. But no. <laughs> the aroma lady's like, something smells gross. That's rude. You need to go hang out with the nice aroma lady. Because you're just rude. Well, it sounds like your mom doesn't want you to drown. She's probably a good mother. Um, yeah, we'll go back out to Paris. I don't think Poliwag usually... Uh, I'm predicting a body slam. Oh, nailed it! You play enough Pokemon and you just kind of get a feel for like the, t the types of moves that the AI gives certain Pokemon. And and Poliwag tends to use like physical fighting moves because it evolves into Poliwrath and so it just starts kind of early. I mean it can get Water Gun and Bubble and stuff, but it's most of the time it's just going to use a physical attacking move. Uh, so we're going to use... Yeah, I'll use a Hyper Potion. Why not? It's all good. It's all good in the hood. That's not where I want to go. And I'll go into the slash. That body slams. It's not bad, but it's definitely not like a great move. I probably just go out the slash, but I wanted the toxic. You know, try something different every now and then. Uh, let's see how much a slash does. Ooh, Rain Dance. I'm kind of wondering about this now. Do you have some move I'm unfamiliar with? Alright, so it's a two hitter. Double Slab. God. It's not even a. Oh, thank you. I'm so used to seeing Double Slap hit like four times. And I'm like, that's not Double Slap anymore, for starters. And then on top of it, that just takes way too long. Like, 
have animation for double slap. Pain in my ass. Okay, well this guy doesn't have body slam anymore. So I think I'm gonna use the paralyze heal. So that we don't keep losing our turn. But we'll sit through this stupid animation like seven times. <gasps> nice. Nice. All right. Oh, you have body slam. Okay, good, it didn't paralyze. You son of a bitch. I'm just gonna use double slap. Oh, you healed your paralysis? No, 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 body slam. You must go down again. That's, wow, plus four to attack at level 40. Good job, Paris, I'm very happy. I worked out really well. What does Rain Dance get you? You don't have Swift Swim. Not that it matters because you're dead, but why would you rain dance? What is going on? <sighs> That's frustrating. Alright, are we at the Berry Forest? Oh, Berry Forest ahead. Alright, well, this is a good place to call it for today. Yeah. Oh no, I went to the Berry Forest. I'm leaving. We're going back into the berry forest in next time in the next episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, consider subscribing, uh, or just you know tell me what you thought in the comments. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.